pleased to be here uh, with uh, two really good friends, uh, State Representative, House Majority uh, Chair of the Appropriations Committee, Dwight Evans, uh, and State Senator Anthony Hardy Williams. Uh, both are not only uh, incredible uh, public servants, uh, but also uh, great friends and great friends to uh, the city of Philadelphia. The tour that we were just on uh, here at the Science Center, one incredible tech technology, uh, two uh, incubated uh, companies, uh, uh, and uh, on the cutting edge of science and technology, but also growth industries uh, for uh, Philadelphia uh, and uh, Commonwealth of Pennsylvania. Uh, a quite a unique tour, uh, some interesting out-of-the-box uh, thinking about how we move uh, technology, how we grow business, how we create jobs, uh, and uh, make Philadelphia and Pennsylvania that much stronger. That leads us uh, to today because uh, I'm going to be talking a little bit about a quite unique uh, individual who also uh, thinks out of the box, looks at different ways of handling the many challenges that this city, this state, and I would suggest this country uh, faces, capitalizing uh, on uh, growth industries and some of the strong uh, elements of our economy. Uh, and at one of the, at, I believe, uh, actually the oldest uh, science incubator uh, and uh, technology center. Uh, certainly uh, here in Philadelphia and possibly across uh, the United States of America. And that is uh, State Senator Anthony Hardy Williams, a great public servant, a uh, son of West Philadelphia, uh, a very good friend of mine and a great friend uh, to the city of Philadelphia. Uh, when you think about uh, his track record on the issue of uh, public safety, on the issues of schools, on the issues of community, economic development, uh, looking out for uh, those uh, not only that uh, have uh, opportunity, but those who don't have opportunity uh, to participate uh, in economic development, uh, in the expansion of opportunities for people in the city and in the state. Uh, I am very pleased uh, to be here uh, this morning, not only on this very important tour, but more importantly, uh, to lend my support and my endorsement uh, for uh, State Senator Anthony Hardy Williams to be uh, the next governor of the Commonwealth of Pennsylvania. This is an exciting moment. This is an exciting moment uh, in our city uh, and in our state. Uh, this is uh, what we're talking about is the opportunity to lead uh, the fifth largest state in the United States of America, a critical uh, state uh, in this country. The city is quite dependent uh, on uh, the Commonwealth of Pennsylvania for any number of challenges that we face. Uh, I've had the opportunity to work with Senator Williams and, of course, uh, Representative Evans uh, in uh, my time as a member of city council as well as, of course, that much more intensely and closely uh, as mayor of the city of Philadelphia. And I would say to you, uh, without hesitation, uh, that but for the efforts of both, but certainly over in the Senate, but for the efforts of uh, State Senator Anthony Hardy Williams, uh, the city would not have been successful uh, last year uh, in our efforts to bring stability uh, to our financial situation. Uh, but again, there are so many, many other issues uh, that the senator has worked on. Securing dollars desperately needed to deal with issues of crime and violence, and specifically uh, going after illegal weapons uh, in Philadelphia. There's been, other than uh, Representative Evans, there's been no greater champion uh, on the issue of education uh, for our young people uh, here in Philadelphia. Finding new opportunities and options for children and their parents uh, to make sure that we uh, maintain a strong uh, educational system, pushing for funding, but also looking for new ways and new opportunities uh, for parents uh, to get the best possible education. Charter schools and charter school options uh, for parents and their children are critically important to the future of the city. You already know my position on education. Education is economic development in Philadelphia. Cutting in half our high school dropout rate, doubling our college degree attainment rate are goals that I laid out on my first day in office uh, over two years ago. And Senator Williams has been a strong, strong champion and partner. Uh, and so I'm pleased to be here, as I mentioned uh, just a second ago, uh, and to lend my support uh, and effort uh, and whatever I can bring uh, to the campaign and whatever the senator needs, uh, I'm going to be there uh, for him. Thank you.